thank you for watching Chenobi. I'm Ruby here and today as you can see here uh, I am going to unbox as well as doing a review today review on Amos my new collection for 2018 as well as my Tiffany and Co. So are you excited? Let's check out together. So as usual this is the Amos orange packaging for their paper bag. Yeah so this is the box and yep i guess you could uh kind of visualize that what i bought a new pair of shoes is just never ending okay um it's not gift wrap because i have already opened it out to check how is it and so as it usual you know that i have purchased i just have this fetish for shoes <laughs> so um yeah classic orange box as you could see are you excited? Let's open it up together with me. Da -da. Da -da. Yes! I bought a new pair of it's not shoes, sandals from Hamas. And they come in a pair of uh, dust bag as you could see here. It has a very strong fragrance that I like it a lot and uh their classic um what do you call that dust bag in the harry bone design yeah so the front has the logo but for the back it's totally plain like what you can see over here yep um they have a official name which is called the Re revenge i'm not sure if i pronounce it correctly but i have the name below is i think it's a french name so um yeah correct so let's check out so in total if i'm not wrong they actually have three colors yep i'll show a picture here for you to see what are the three other colors that is available and you could actually find it out from the uh, website and so are you able to guess what color did i purchase for myself well i decided to be a very traditional lady and I got my very first pet in black. So when you remove it from the dust bag, it actually comes in a plastic, like what you can see here. So when you remove it from the plastic, this is where you get to see my pair of slippers, sandals immediately. And there is a stuffing, yeah, black stuffing. And the other side, the same. A plastic uh, a plastic packaging and then a slipper yeah correct so this is how it looks in a pair black is extremely light and flat so I guess it's really suitable for traveling and for Singapore raining weather I tell you this is gonna be awesome so I place it in a higher view so it's easier for me to share with you and you could take a look at the shoes while I'm talking non-stop <laughs> all right uh, as you can see there is actually three stripes yeah so uh, the first one is actually in matte color and then the PVC at the second and the third stripe is actually more shining could you see Oh, if you notice, I've actually changed my hall light to white lighting. So it's actually easier for you guys to, to see me when I'm doing my video. Yeah. Did you see? Yeah, correct. So um, the design of the, the tree stripe is also different. Could you see? It's actually closer over here. And then the second and the third one is of another design. So it's the same for the other side as well. Yeah. Yeah, right. Let me remove the stuffing so you could see how it looks like. And from the side view, you could see that they are, are very well like design it just stand out really well i'm not sure is it because the stuffing has been placed properly but without the stuffing i think it's actually quite hard so i don't think it'll be out of shape easily the interior sole of the sanders is also in matte, matte black as well and there is a brand logo over here could you see yeah could 
Could you see? Um, the logo in the interior sole is both exactly the same. And then the back, there is uh, some friction design. Yep. So I have actually got uh, size 37. So it's actually stated at the back. And make in Italy and the brand logo again. Yeah. And the design from far, it looks as though it's like H H H H H H wall drill up. Yeah, correct. So this is a very consistent in terms of uh, detail. And it's a really affordable pair of sanders. So I love it a lot. And it's, it's I would say like, um, it's not that sort of arch sort of sanders. So I would not say that it's extremely comfortable, but it's a decent sort of comfortability. I really love it and it's black. It could be easily matched, right? So shortly, I'll show you a modeling of me um, wearing this pair of sandals and you could check it out. So now let's continue with the Tiffany & Co item that I have newly purchased and yes I have already opened and used it so um it's no longer in that 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 ribbon so and I'm not really good at tying ribbon so forgive forgive me if I did not try my very best to make it back to how it looks in its original form. So this is how it comes in the box as well as the ribbon on it. <laughs> yeah, I've removed and I already started using. Sorry. So yeah, and what does it comes with? So um, this is actually how they actually place the uh, receipt within the envelope. Yeah, and then this is like a, a gift card, but it's a present to myself, so nothing. So yeah. Are you excited to know what I've actually purchased for myself? Ta -da! Yes! I got myself a necklace. So it comes with this in this pouch. I've never purchased their ring before, so I'm not sure if their ring come in such pouch or is those, you know, those ring box whereby your ring will actually be stationary in a position. So it's a Tiffany & Co. Uh, drawstring pouch as you could see uh, the material I think is a little it seems a little velvet but I don't think so it's more of like cotton sort of fabric to me so I'm not too sure and the interior pouch compartment they actually have like could you see they have another fabric with within so it means that like if you're placing more than one item within you could separate them because there's an interior thing so you do not have to bring more than one pouch so that's very smart and then dun. this is the infinity necklace that i have purchased So as you could see, uh, this is the pendant in, me in the middle and then yeah, the gold chain is all the way to the end of the hood, the nook, I think it's called the nook, I'll google about that. And then uh, on the chain is actually indicated uh, a wording on it AU750 yeah and, and they have like wording over here like indicating Tiffany and Co and uh, AU750 that I mentioned earlier and this is it let me try it on for you guys to see how it looks on me looks on me yeah, so I have purposely wear a black top today so that when I'm wearing a necklace on it, it will be very, very obvious. 
and then just in case if you're interested in my Chanel brooch um, you could check on the link above and this is the link that uh, shown that I bought this brooch um, during my Korea trip and I think it's really versatile like look at today I'm actually um, placing it on top of my this um, this top and it's actually printed tops and it does match really well with it as well uh, I guess because of the this this uh, brooch actually comes with three colors sort of um, design so it could pretty much match well with a lot of other items and so this is back to my focus this is my necklace and and everything looks really good what do you think That's it for today. I hope you like my review on my new purchase in 2018. And if you have any comments, uh, anything that you want to know, you could drop at the feedback below. And put a thumbs up, like, if you like my videos. It's a motivation for us. And I hope you could subscribe to our channel. And that's it. Bye-bye.